Hi, in this video we're going to show you how to increase and decrease the size of a volume on a hard drive. So we have the volume shown on this computer. We have our C drive, our data drive, and our recovery drive, plus our DVD, ROM, and flash drive. So what we're going to do is go into disk management. So you can just type that from search is the best way to get there. There's other ways to do it. And then look for create and format hard disk partitions. You could also type the same thing in Cortana if you're on Windows 10. And on this computer we have a new drive put in there, disk 3, unallocated space, so it's just a blank hard drive with no volumes. So we're going to start by creating a volume, so a new simple volume, and we're going to pick 500 gigabytes out of the 1 terabyte, and we'll give it the drive letter, let's just go all the way down to Z, make it easier to find, and we'll call this new drive, and do a quick format. Okay, so now we have our new drive here, empty, so we're going to put in a file, text file, and we'll call this data, and we'll open it up, put in data there, drag that over, or do that, save it. So now we're going to go back to our disk management, so now we have this 500, actually 500 megabyte drive, not gigabyte drive, and so there it is right there. And now we want to increase the space on it. So we're going to take up the rest of the space here, this 420, 492 megabytes. We're going to take up the rest of that space. So we're using all the space on this drive. So we're going to right click, extend volume, go next. That's our disk that we're going to use. That's what's free. So we could have, you know, we could have put 200 and left a little bit left over if we wanted to, but we're going to use all of it. Click on next and finish. Now you can see we've got this 990 megabyte drive, and if we go back to this PC, refresh it, there we go, and then you'll notice too, we still have our file, and it still has our data in it, so our, our data on our drive did not get affected by this, and so now let's say we want to go back and decrease it, because we want to use make another partition for something else, so we right click on it, and shrink volume, and let's say we want to go take it down 500 and shrink. And so now we have it split in half here, so we could use this to make another volume with a different letter if we wanted to. And if we go back to our PC, refresh, now we'll see what's half the size there. And then open our data file, and our data is still safe. So in Windows, you could go through and make a you know, new volume on a new physical hard drive. This is a virtual drive just for the sake of demonstration here and you could increase it and decrease it without affecting your data and you probably don't want to try that on your C drive because we're going to run into some problems but I mean for extra drives that you have um, it'll work out just fine. Alright, thanks for watching.